Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening, teacher. How was your day? I'm fine. Fine, good. Thank you, Becky. Have you already finished the test? Have you? Um? La plataforma? Yes, the test, the final test. Yes. Good. And what about you, Elisa? Have you finished the final test? Yes, yes, teacher. Good, both of you. Then you are going to give me copy. <laughs> I will copy from you. Today we will check the final test. Okay. And that way we finish all the platform. But on Thursday and Friday, you are going to tell us about your dreaming vacation. Hi, Benjamin. Hi. Tiene problemas de conexión. Ya vamos cinco. Faltan diecisiete. <laughs> Good evening. Hello. Yes, thank you. But we cannot listen you well because it was like problems with the connectivity. Yes, I hear you. I hear you. But it was like broken. What about now? Now it's better. Okay, it's better. thank you. Okay. Esmeralda de la Cruz and Patricia Martinez. Eight people. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. 14 more people and we started. I already have the listening here. We will be listening to the to the audio three times. And then we are going to uh, complete the questions. Okay? I guess that three times is too much. Maybe just 
two times. Eleven more people, and we start. It's not time yet, neither. How is the weather in El Salvador? Is it raining? Sorry, sorry. Normal, please. Aquí dice que los mutea todo, yo no mutea. <risa> dice que yo los mutea todos, yo no he muteado a nadie. Dio cuarto. Ellos solo se mutearon, dicho. No, es el, el cómo se llama. Nos sacó el zoom a todos. Y cuando nos vuelve a entrar, nos, nos mutea. Porque hasta a mí me mutea. Está haciendo lo mismo esta cosa otra vez. Eh, do you have problems in El Salvador? ¿Está lloviendo en El Salvador? No, teacher. No, teacher. Okay. No. Solo viento fuerte. Ah, strong winds. Here we had strong winds too. And my last uh, banana plant fell off with the bananas branch. And I decided to cut it. And I started to divide the 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 the, the plantains, and I hurt myself. This was yesterday. <laughs> In, okay, it's raining right now. Says chill. No, it's here. It's not raining, but it was a strong wind. Uh, it it makes the banana plant to fall off because it has a, a, a big bunch of, of bananas and then it, it was too heavy for it and with the wind it fell off se cayó se dobló okay 16 people six more people Y les dije que trataran de venir temprano. Bueno, como vamos a oír dos veces el, el, el listening, este, empecémoslo a escuchar y después, ojalá que ya cuando lo oigamos por segunda vez ya estén los demás, porque ya es oro. O los esperamos cinco minutos. It's okay, wait for them. Ah, she said that in Morazan is raining. See, it is raining in El Salvador. Here we don't have rain for a long time. I guess that this rainy season will be very dry here in, in Panama. Last year, we we didn't have dry season. No tuvimos temporada sec. Llovió todo el año. Pero hoy ya debería de haber empezado el invierno y no ha, no ha llovido. No tuvieron calor, dicho. Está haciendo un gran calor. Igual que acá. Eh, bueno, es que aquí como es bien costero, ¿verdad? O sea, aunque llueva, siempre hace calor. Qué raro. Sí. Con la costa. ¿no? Ajá. La ventaja es que hay bosques cerca, entonces eso hace que, 
que por lo menos hay algo de oxígeno. <risa> <risa> y el oxígeno hace que nos supuestamente... Le ha agarrado feo el Zoom. Pero nos saca y no vuelve a entrar. La... Es eso, Santiche, por los vientos. Ah, puede ser por los vientos también. Y no, y yo insisto, también ha de ser el, 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 eso de, de los satélites que, que ha puesto el Elon Musk para dar, para dar este internet ha de interferir con las otras señales de internet verdad la verdad que sí pero bueno aquí vamos a ir ya yeah. this is the last week a ver eh Está, estoy compartiéndole, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Yes, teacher. Sí. Yes. Ok. Sure. Bien, entonces vamos a irnos ya con el listening. ¿Escuchan bien? Yes. Ok. Yes. Nos volvió a sacar. Pero yo siento que es por eso, porque el día bastante fuerte. Sí, o sea, sí. La señal. Bien, pero primero día vamos a poder terminar. Por eso me gusta empezar antes. Por cualquier problema. Vaya. Let's listen. Quiz. Part A. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. One. I just love my new apartment. That's great, Jen. What do you like about it? Everything. First of all, it's not as noisy as my old apartment. Yeah, it was pretty noisy. And another thing, it has two bathrooms. My family visits me often, so it'll be more convenient. That's good. And what's the rent like? That's what I like the most. It's not as expensive as my old apartment. I can finally start saving some money. Two. I was late to work again today. There's just too much traffic. I know. And then there are never enough parking spaces. Exactly. I can never find a place to park my car. So, Seth, why don't you move downtown? You could live near your office. I'd like to. The problem is, I really can't afford to live downtown. It's too expensive. But at least you could save some money by walking to work. Three. I wish I could find a new apartment. I'm ready for a change. Why, Karen? What's wrong with the place you're living now? Well, it's dingy and cramped. I don't know why I rented it in the first place. I mean, it's very safe and private. I just wish it weren't so small. What kind of place are you looking for exactly? Some place that's more spacious, but not too expensive. Good luck. Four. So, Doug, how do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's great. What do you like about it? Do you remember how dark my old apartment was? Yeah, it was kind of depressing. Well, my new apartment is on the top floor, so it's nice and bright. Is there anything you don't like? Some of the apartments on the first floor have a small garden, and I'd like to grow flowers or maybe a few vegetables. So I kind of wish I lived on the first floor. I guess you can't have everything. Okay. Do you want to listen again? Oh, there's 22 people already. Then listen again. Mm -hmm. 
Units 3 to 4 Quiz Part A Listen to the conversations. Check the correct answers. 1. I just love my new apartment. That's great, Jen. What do you like about it? Everything. First of all, it's... Okay, listen again. About it. Everything. First of all, it's not as noisy as my old apartment. Yeah, it was pretty noisy. And another thing, it has two bathrooms. My family visits me often, so it'll be more convenient. That's good. And what's the rent like? That's what I like the most. It's not as expensive as my old apartment. I can finally start saving some money. Okay, Jane likes her new apartment because it has two beds. Uh huh. And what else? It's cheap. It's cheaper. Than it's her. cheaper than her old apartment. Excellent. Now let's continue. Two. I was late to work again today. There's just too much traffic. I know. Ay, ay, ay. Menos mal nos saca y nos vuelve a meter. Okay. Let's continue. Two. I was late to work again today. There's just too much traffic. I know. And then there are never enough parking spaces. Exactly. I can never find a place to park my car. So, Seth, yeah. why don't you move downtown? You could live near your office. I'd like to. The problem is, I really can't afford to live downtown. It's too expensive. But at least you could save some money by walking to work. Three. I wish I could find a new apartment. I'm ready for a change. Why, Karen? What's wrong with... Okay. Uh, can you see the... the... the test? I am... am I sharing the test? Hello? Yes. Okay. Yes, now... Seth wants to live downtown because he, he, works, there. 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 he works there. He works there. Okay. Now. Apartment. I'm ready for a change. Why, Karen? What's wrong with the place you're living now? Well, it's dingy and cramped. I don't know why I rented it in the first place. I mean, it's very safe and private. I just wish it weren't so small. What kind of place are you looking for exactly? Some place that's more spacious, but not too expensive. Good luck. Okay, Karen's apartment is? Too small. Too small, excellent. Four. So, Doug, how do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's great. What do you like about it? Do you remember how dark my old apartment was? Yeah, it was kind of depressing. Is there anything you don't like? Some of the apartments on the first floor have a small garden, and I'd like to grow flowers or maybe a few vegetables. So I kind of wish I lived on the first floor. I guess you can't have everything.
Okay, Doug, which is his apartment where? On the first, um, the floor. first floor. On the first floor, okay. No me lo acepta. No lo acepta. Vamos a ver. It's cheaper. He was there. Okay. It is correct now. Well, it's correct now, okay? It was, Jane likes her new apartment because it is cheaper than her old apartment. Seth wants to live downtown because he works there. Karen's apartment is too small and the wishes his new apartment were on the first floor, okay? Now, vocabulary. Uh, Selma Yamilet, uh, read number one, please. I love my neighborhood. It's scary. Which do you think is the best adjective for I love my neighborhood? <laughs> It's Safe. very letter B. Letter. It's very safe, okay? Because you wouldn't love a neighborhood that is dangerous uh, or a neighborhood that is inconvenient, okay? So the positive is safe. Now, number two, Lisbeth, could you read it, please? Yeah, good evening. Good evening. I live on a bus street. It's mm -hmm. getting a little bit spacious. No, if the busy the, the street is busy, it is noisy. Si, si, hay, si hay mucha gente en la, en la calle, entonces es noisy, no spacious, ¿ok? Ah, uh, sorry, noisy. Ajá, uh -huh. <laughs> noisy, noisy, ¿ok? No. Now, number three. Eh, Benjamin, could you read it, please? Which one? Number three. Number three. It's uh, convenient to have parking space near my apartment. Okay, it's convenient. Thank you very much. Now, Carlos Mauricio, number four, please. Number four, okay. Mm. Um, let me see. Our house is modern and very bright. It has few windows. Few, 
cube windows. Cube. Excellent. Mm -hmm. yes. Let's see. No las quiere agarrar. Lo que le digo, la conexión. La cosa es que si no lo mandamos, no nos dice si está bien o mal. Vamos a ver otra vez. I love my neighborhood. It's very safe. I live on a very busy street. It can get a little bit noisy. It's convenient to have parking spaces near my apartment. Our house is modern and very bright. It has huge windows. Ok. Creo que, creo que está dando problemas de compatibilidad Zoom con la plataforma. Porque cuando se va a Zoom, entonces sí, la plataforma me acepta las, las respuestas. Y cuando viene Zoom, se me, acaba, se me, se me apaga la plataforma. Ay. cayéndonos y levantándonos pero vamos a terminar bueno para mientras vamos a leer el eh, este es del, del último del reading pero como no está cargando el, el de vocabulario entonces vamos a ir al reading Ve, aquí está, estamos correctos, ok, with the vocabulary. Now, continue. Not enough. Uh, this is also complete the sentences, use not enough and the words given, ok. Now, uh, Brenda Isabel, could you read number one, please? Brenda Isabel. Creí que estaba. Number one. Number one. It's too small. There are not in rooms. Not enough. Not enough rooms. Excellent. Not enough rooms. Thank you. Esmeralda de la Cruz, number two, please. People can see into our house. There is. Uh huh. Not enough. Not enough. Not enough. Um, People can space. see into our house. People can see into our uh -huh. house. Uh -huh. There is not enough. There is not um, previous and now. Not enough not privacy. Enough. Not enough privacy. Yes. Okay. Privacy. Thank you. Now, Patricia Martinez. 
Number three. Sorry, the teacher. I care is too small. It doesn't help. No, it does. it's based now and now. No, it doesn't have. Number three. Number three. No space. Eh, no. Aquí, si te fijas, y como dice doesn't, aquí ya tenés el not. Que okay. it doesn't have. Sería eso. Not space. Enough, Excellent. No space. Enough space. Okay. Okay, 12 of 12. Correct. Now, let's continue. As many or as much. Remember that many for countables and much for non-countables. Okay. Brian and Steve, could you read number one, please? My apartment does have uh, as many windows as my old one. Okay, thank you very much. Now, uh, Roberto Eduardo. Uh, number two. Yes. Uh, our house is as a convenient as a, your apartment. As convenient the number, as your apartment. Okay, thank yeah, the, you. The number two. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Leslie Natalie, number three, please. Mother and parents often don't have older ones. Mother and parents often don't have. Which is the answer? Hello? Which is the answer? Modern apartments often don't have. Claudia Herrera. Oscar Antonio. Yes, teacher. Could you tell me which is the answer for number three, please? Okay. Modern apartments. Modern apartment often don't have as much space uh all the ones okay thank you very much Okay, 12 of 12. 
Estamos bien. Let's continue. Expressing wishes. I don't like my new job. I wish. Were more fun. It were more fun. It were more fun. Okay. Now, number two. Uh, Miley, could you read it, please? I can find my new cell phone. I wish I could find, find I wish I could find it. Okay, thank you. Neftali Antonio, number three, please. Okay, teacher. <laughs> My boyfriend isn't in a good shape. I wish, <laughs> I wish he were in good shape. He were in good shape. De alguien se acordó. Ah, no, ya entendí. <risa> Nada que ver. Usted solo está haciendo un ejercicio, no se preocupe. <risa> bueno, además, además hay dos tipos de boyfriend. O sea, usted puede decir my boyfriend, o sea, que no es que sea su novio, sino que es su amigo. ¿Verdad? O sea, boyfriend. Y la girlfriend también, o sea, que es una amiga. O sea, porque si usted solo dice friend, no se sabe si es mujer o hombre. Pero si usted dice boyfriend o girlfriend, entonces sí. Pero la única diferencia es que eso se escribe con guioncito. O sea, boy, guioncito, friend, y girl, guioncito, friend. Pero no significa que sean novios. Ok. Let's continue. Now, uh, the use of present perfect and simple past. Uh, do you remember what was the structure for present perfect? ¿Se acuerdan cuál yes. era la estructura del presente perfecto? Ajá, ¿cuál era la estructura? ¿Ocupábamos cuál auxiliar? Have or has. Have or has. Have or has. Ajá. En the, in the verb, we use the verb. Participle. Oh, excellent. And in the case of simple past, what happened with the verb? In simple past. Simple past. We use the past, okay, the past tense. But we also use the auxiliary, which was the auxiliary? Was, where? Sí, ese para, para, para el pasado de, de verbo to be. Y para los other than be. Okay, and for the others than be? Which is the auxiliary for others than B? ¿Cuál es el auxiliar para los other than B? Did. 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 Y lo utilizamos para? For questions. Questions and Ooh, negative, negative statements, negative uh, statements and questions. Okay. And what about have? O sea, el, el, el auxiliar have se ocupa solo para negativas y, 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 y preguntas también en el presente perfecto. Sí o no? Uh, 
Yo se lo dije en clase. Que para el presente perfecto siempre se, se ocupa el auxiliar have or has desde el afirmativo, a diferencia del, pa del pasado simple que solo utilizamos el auxiliar did cuando eh, vamos a hacer un negativo o una pregunta. Entonces, en el presente perfecto se ocupa siempre desde, o sea que siempre, tanto en afirmativo, negativo e interrogativo. ¿Ok? Now. Ok. Entonces, empecemos. Number one. Eh, Claudia Herrera, could you read number one, please? Ahorita. Have you ever eaten Spanish food? Okay, thank you very much. Now, eh, Neftali Antonio. Number two, please. Okay. Yes. I have, I went to Spanish restaurant last week. Okay, yes, I have, I went to a Spanish restaurant last week. Thank you very much. Now, number three, Lisbeth Martinez. Yes, teacher. Did you, did you, eat, did you like it? Did you like it? Thank you very much. And Daniela Magali, number four, please. Jocelyn Natalia. Sí, teacher. Could you do number four, please? Number four sería, yes, it was delicious. Yes, it was delicious. Thank you very much. Okay, 12 o 12. Y esto no me lo aceptó. No me acepta las, como que ya se hizo. Vamos a, voy a salir que no lo he terminado. <risa> ok, now. Eh, simple present versus. Ok, now. Future with will and be going to. Esto lo acabamos de ver. Entonces. Eh, Edgar Fernando. Could you do number one, please? Edgar Fernando. Jonathan Alemán. Uh, yes. Uh, Could you help us second. with number one, please? Uh, okay, number one. What? What are you going to do after class today? Okay, thank you very much. Wendy Cecilia. Could you help us with number two, please? Yes, sir. I am definitely, definitely going to watch a movie with a friend. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Carla Melissa, could you help us with number three? Tenia López, are you there? 
when are they going to take their vacations? When are they going to take their vacation? Thank you very much. Now, Elisa Areli. I think they will go on a cruise in June or July. Will go, okay. Okay, correct. Now the last part. Is the reading comprehension. Now, uh, first just follow the reading and then we will repeat it, okay? Hi, Paula. Greetings from Bangkok. Fernando and I are having a really good time. It's a great city for shopping. Yesterday, we went to a huge weekend market. It was full of really interesting things to buy, especially clothes. And the prices are great. Things here are not nearly as expensive as they are at home. Of course, Fernando tells me I'm spending too much money, but you know him. problemas, teacher. Sí. Seguimos con problemas. Okay. Uh, it was full of really interesting things to buy, especially clothes. And the prices are great. Things here are not nearly as expensive as they are at home. Of course, Fernando tells me I'm spending too much money, but you know him, he never buys anything. Have you ever eaten Thai food? It's delicious. We just had a wonderful dinner in one of the restaurants on the river. Fernando ordered green curry and rice, and I had my favorite dish, me crab, crispy noodles with shrimp and chicken. For dessert, we had fried bananas. Everything was so good. It was also fun to watch the boats pass by. One thing I've noticed is that some restaurants make their curries less spicy for foreigners. Yesterday, I told our waiter, this curry isn't hot enough for us. He smiled and said, some foreigners don't like spicy food. Then he brought us another curry that was much hotter. Time to stop. We are flying home tomorrow, so I'll see you soon, Rosa. Okay, who is writing the, the email? Casi vamos terminando, ya casi. Toda la hora ha sido de salirnos y volvernos a entrar, pero vamos a terminar. Teacher, please repeat the questions. Eh, who is the one who writes the email? This is an email. Who writes it? The food. No, ¿quién la escribió? Who writes it? Estas preguntas las estoy haciendo yo solo para ver cómo están ustedes con la comprehensive reading. Eh, who writes the letter? 
¿Quién la escribió? ¿Quién escribió el email? Rosa. 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 Ok. And who is she? No. What is she writing about? ¿Sobre qué está escribiendo? Food? Yes, about uh -huh. food. What else? Place for shopping. Uh -huh. uh, where is she? What city? In She's Bangkok. in Bangkok. She's in Bangkok. Okay. Who is she with? Supposedly. Con quién está supuestamente? Fernando. 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 ¿Y quién creen que es Fernando? Ahí no dice quién es Fernando, pero ustedes así de lo que se puede leer ahí. Que Fernando se está quejando is de friend? que no se está gastando. Is friends? Is friends o is Mario? No, yo creo que es el esposo. Porque si yo fuera solo la amiga de alguien, no le ando diciendo que uh -huh. está gastando mucho. Yeah. <risa> yeah. Yo creo que es el esposo porque le duele que esté gastando. <risa> okay. Yes, de the, the... Okay, let's see. Bangkok is a good place for shopping. It's true or false? True. 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 Okay. Now, uh, Brian and Steve, could you read number two, please? I love you so much. Much, much. Oh, it's so lindo. <laughs> number two. I love you so much too. Number two, Brian you can, and Steve. You can buy most things except clothes in the market. It's true or false? False. False. Porque dice que especially clothes, ¿verdad? Now, eh, Lisbeth Martinez. Number three. Princess Edgar are very reasonable. It's true. The prices in the market are very reasonable. reasonable. True. Okay. Now, uh, Neftali Antonio, number four, please. Yeah, teacher. Micro the Thai name for Gary is false. False. ¿Qué es el micro? Fried noodles with shrimps. Okay. Now, uh, number five. Uh, volunteer. Mi teacher. Okay, go ahead. Number five. All for her visitors love Thailand's hot and spicy food is false. It's false. Thank you. Okay. With that, we finish. We finish. Finally. <ríe> Al fin terminamos. Ya ven, cayéndonos y levantándonos. Ok. Now, for tomorrow, we have the day off. Ok. But we are going to see each other eh, on Thursday. Remember that you have, all of you, all of you have to talk us about your dream vacation.
you may present it as you wish. Lo pueden presentar como quieran. If you want, you can make PPTs. Pueden hacer PPTs, ¿verdad? Or if you want, you can share uh, pictures of the places that you want to go. Or you can use your creativity as you wish. Pueden usar su creatividad como quieran. Or you, uh, you can only talk about it. Solo pueden hablar sobre eso, no hay problema. Eh, no, no, no es eh, lo que hicieron en el pasado, sino que a dónde le gustaría ir, ¿verdad? En el futuro. Porque vamos a ocupar will y going to, que es lo que estábamos viendo en la última sección, ¿verdad? Entonces vamos a hablar en el futuro, a dónde usted le gustaría ir. O sea, ¿dónde sueña con ir a conocer? ¿Ok? Si alguno quiere venir a, aquí a Panamá, me avisa para irlo a traer. <ríe> al, 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 ¿Cómo se llama? Al aeropuerto. <ríe> Good idea. Sí, ¿Verdad? Ok. Eh, remember your dream vacation. Eh, traten de hablar por lo menos, qué sé yo. A ver, somos 22 personas y tienen dos horas. Tienen dos horas porque tienen la hora del jueves y la hora del viernes, ¿verdad? Entonces, además de hacer su presentación, trate de hacer preguntas para que la gente esté eh, poniendo atención porque al final ustedes van a hacer preguntas de lo que ustedes hablaron. ¿Verdad? Para ver si la gente puso atención. Y usted va a escoger a quién le va a preguntar. O sea, nadie sabe a quién le va a preguntar. ¿Ok? Entonces, todos vamos a estar atentos a lo que usted esté diciendo. Si tiene alguna duda o pregunta con respecto a eh, palabras, aunque yo siento que ustedes hablan bastante bien el inglés, creo que no van a necesitar mucho sobre pronunciación, pero aún así, si necesitan saber algo de pronunciación, ahí en el WhatsApp, me preguntan y yo les ayudo. ¿Ok? Then, eh, okay. ¿Alguna duda o consulta con respecto a lo que vamos a hacer? Sí, eh, me, me perdí un poquito, teacher. Vamos a hacer, vamos a platicar sobre algo que queremos ir a conocer. Sí, o sea, ¿a dónde le gustaría ir y qué le gustaría hacer? Usando ah, Will okay. y Going to. Uh -huh. Vaya, Como perfecto. planes, hacer sus planes de vacación. Teacher, Dígame. Gracias, teacher. Podría poner, aunque sea un recordatorio allí sobre esto. En el, a veces en el WhatsApp. Señor... En el WhatsApp. Sí, por favor. Vaya, perfecto. Yes. Yo les pongo el recordatorio. ¿Qué más? ¿Ya todos terminaron eh, lo que era el test? De, de el final yes. test. Teacher. Toditos, toditos. Entonces ya no debemos nada. Yes. No. Perfecto. Entonces el jueves, mañana, eh, for the ones that are already mothers, congratulations. And greet, your, you. greet your mothers on my behalf. O sea, me saludan a sus madrecitas en, 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 <laughs> en, 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 en mi nombre. For all of you. Okay. No todos pueden ser madres, pero todos tienen una madre. Ok, entonces me la saludan de parte mía y pásenla bonito, ¿verdad? Atiéndanlas. Ok, ahora sí, nos despedimos, ¿verdad? Toda la hora nos dio problemas esta cosa, pero terminamos. We finish. <ríe> ok. Gracias, Tiché. See you night. on Thursday. Take care. See you okay. Thursday. Okay, bye bye. I see you. Bye. Bye. Yes. bye. Okay, take care, all of you.